You might think given the name non-invasive ventilation, that this form of respiratory support is designed to improve the patient's ventilation. It certainly can improve gas exchange in a variety of pulmonary diseases. Ventilation refers to the exchange of oxygen for carbon dioxide. The minute ventilation of the respiratory system is the amount of air moved in and out by a patient in one minute. It's defined as the respiratory rate times the tidal volume. The tidal volume is the volume of air inspired with each breath. Non-invasive ventilation is most commonly delivered as a spontaneous mode of ventilation. This means that patients control their intrinsic respiratory rate and the ventilator does not provide a minimum respiratory rate outside of emergency backup modes. We know that non-invasive ventilation improves patients' ventilation, but since it does not directly influence the respiratory rate, it must exert its effect on the tidal volume. Non-invasive ventilation allows an efficiency of breathing, and the added pressure during inspiration augments the volume of air that is inspired, i.e. the tidal volume. Increases in tidal volume improve ventilation of the entire lung. Another method of improving ventilation relates to the intrinsic pressure created by the airways at the end of expiration, which is termed intrinsic positive end expiratory pressure, or intrinsic PEEP. In some disease states, the airway may be constricted, making it more difficult for air, and carbon dioxide, to be released during expiration, and this results in hyperinflated alveoli. Non-invasive ventilation can counteract this pressure to allow improved expiration. When the PEEP from the NIV ventilator is able to allow intrinsic pressure, that is intrinsic PEEP, from the alveoli to escape, there is improvement in ventilation and in carbon dioxide exchange. So there you have it. The physiology behind how non-invasive ventilation can improve your patient's ventilation. So I hope you liked this video. Absolutely make sure to check out the course this video was taken from and to register for a free trial account which will give you access to selected chapters of the course. If you want to learn how MetMastery can help you become a great clinician, make sure to watch the About MetMastery video. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you again soon.